we're standing in the front of the staircase to our attic. The attic that needs to be cleared and empty for future projects. So, we've got our gloves on, we've got garbage bags, and we're going in. Let's, Let's go! go. Good morning, welcome to another day on the homestead. I'm back in overalls, wearing a cap, having my mouth guard ready because we are in the attic and we are going to try to clear out as much as we can while um, light will last on this fall day. There is a lot of stuff here. Lex has been bagging up a lot of it, but it all needs to be taken down. So that's what we're gonna stu start today. found primitive computer number two. Seems to be one of those slate plates with carvings on the top to make it into some sort of a noteboard. Quite cute. Don't know if I'll ever do something with it. Who knows? That was a dusty job. <laughs> Scary also. But um, this first corner of the attic is now done. You can waltz in it. Thank you. 
love with this trunk ever since we first stepped onto this attic. Um, I've tried opening the drawers a few times, but it never worked. Today we tried to move it and it was so heavy, so we did another attempt. And we managed to open the bottom drawer and it was filled with old grain sacks and burlap sacks. Now we took it out and then we investigated further. And the second drawer here had a fake uh, lock. So we got to think maybe this bottom one isn't a drawer at all. So then Lex did this. Ta-da! Ta-da! Turns out this is a trunk and not a chest with drawers. And well, I don't know what this is. It's not my, uh, grandma's wedding dress, but it's something. So let's investigate what comes out of this trunk. <music> wedding dress it wasn't. What it was in fact was an enormous heap of burlap sacks, some of them pretty good, with on top of it a real feather down duvet. And in these past years something has been living in between those feathers so they're now everywhere. It's gonna be quite a little job getting rid of all those feathers. <music> Okay, Project Attic, part two, let's go. Try to make the turn with these long boards, but it doesn't work. So, tool time!
wonder how many attics all over the world are filled like this. <laughs> Probably a lot. But ours is a little bit more empty right now. We're halfway now. I think we're maybe even more than halfway. We'll show you in a minute. Okay, that's it for this week. Join us next week when we finish clearing out the attic. We have three more small spaces to clear and then we're done. And then we can use the attic for other projects. Bye.